So live reporting from Jerusalem here. I'm just about to get on the train to go back to Tel Aviv and uh, this happens so I can't really explain it so I'll just let the camera run. You know what's going on? Of course, no, they're protesting. Oh, okay. They arrested someone. Oh, I see. Okay. So the cars have been bought, uh, brought to a standstill. It looks like um, a little bit of a rowdy incident going on in several places in the middle there. I'm standing well back. Uh, this is in my country. I don't know my boundaries. But, uh, Please believe me, not anyone. OK. OK, yeah. I'm, I don't know what's going on, so... I see, yeah, yeah. I know, I see, I see, yeah. So we've got the police, or some type of par paramilitary <laughs> with horses. We've got some uh, green shirted uh, param paramilitary, um, the police flashing and then um, some protesters. Seems to be little um, kids really um, getting in the way of the traffic. <clears throat> Interesting commentary there from one of the locals. And uh, we want to get out of the way of those horses damn quick. <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, but I'm not really familiar with these types of things. So those horses are really drawing people back there. So I'll have to uh, check the news later <laughs> and find out exactly what's going on. Nobody's got any batons or, you know, water cannon or anything like that. Wow, he's nearly being run over there. Can we get a better angle? <clears throat> so the horses are coming. People feel a bit scared of the horses. Is it the horses they're scared of or? Wow. <clears throat> but 
last time I saw something like this was in Beijing. Totally different scenario, but people got seriously hurt. <clears throat> the question is, how long to keep the camera rolling? Is this it now? That's Sod's Law. As soon as the camera goes off, something, something interesting will happen. Well, even more interesting than this. <coughs> wow, isn't it an amazing world we live in now? that we can, um, everybody has a camera, a decent quality camera in their pockets these days. And, you know, years ago, this just wouldn't have been even possible to document this or store it, have a watch of it later. <laughs> I'm laughing out of um, confusion more than it's not not funny, but wow, it's not an everyday occurrence for me. Doesn't look like it is for these guys either, actually. Zoom in a bit. So I think they're just trying to clear the traffic. <coughs> Must be prime time, so I think the, the timing and the location was all done for maximum uh, publicity. Certainly caused quite a stir here. People are arguing. But I'm under an olive tree anyway, so it's the tree of peace. <laughs> good action, no good action. <laughs> What's going on? Um, they're upset that they uh, they arrested someone, the religious people, they arrested okay. someone for two weeks. Right. That really to be I started. see, I see. And they're protesting. Yeah, I was just about to catch the train back to Tel Aviv and it all happened. Uh, oh, thanks for the commentary. Roger, they come with a big spray. Yeah. Don't spray. No, I don't want to get sprayed. I don't want any trouble. <laughs> Stand there, you're good. Yeah. Where do they come from with the spray? Which way? Right from that way. No.
sorry about the traffic's piling up now. Scary cats. <laughs> Wow, better get out of here. Laugh at the movie. Let's go! Oops. 
Then I get out the way. Oh shit. I'm getting out of here. I've had enough. I stand out like a sore thumb as well. But that was pretty scary. I'm going for the train. I'll Google this later. Whew. Beer gas has come out, hence everybody's running. I'm doing the tourist thing, you know? Yeah. Uh, quick video. Yeah, here's my new friend. He's taking me to the station. Israeli defense. And everybody in Israel has to do it when they're 18 for two years. Men and women. And it's such a good thing. We should bring this back in England. Jerusalem. Ooh. Interesting day out. So, back to Tel Aviv now on the train. <laughs> Over and out.